All right, guys, this is a quick little sneak peek preview of the editor I'm using on mobile application now of CodeDam. That is, you can code on VS Code on CodeDam now if you're using iOS. So you could see that once you log in the application, what you have to do is go to the pra practice section. You can go ahead and start practicing with these courses or you, what you can do is go ahead and go into the playground part. So once you go into playground, what you could do is just go ahead and try out some HTML, CSS and JavaScript right here. And what you could do is go to the output section to see the output of your code. So what I'm going to do is just go ahead right here and uh, let's just see. I'm going to enable the wrapping first because we're going to write some big code. So I'm just going to say that. Uh, all right, let's see what we could say. Um, I don't know. Maybe let's just create a button first of all. So I'm just gonna go ahead and create a button, and I'm gonna say click me, and I'm gonna close this button off real quick, right? And I'm gonna say document dot get element, or maybe like query select rather. Oops, query select i'm gonna say and i'm doing all this on the go right if you're on a uh you know on uh, you're traveling and if you want to code button on click so this is a nice way to spend your time and this is an es6 arrow function and what i want here is this to say a lot and i could just and we can all agree on how cool this is, right? And yeah, let's just make some more space for us. And there we go. So if we go ahead now and take a look in the output section, we see a nice little click me button. And once we click on this, you see how cool this is, right? So this is how you can code on mobile applications right now. If you guys are on Android, you won't actually get a VS Code experience. On Android, you're gonna make use of Code Mirror, but it's equally good. But on iOS, currently I'm shipping with VS Code. I, I am trying to stabilize VS Code on Android as well, just like we have here on this platform, but for some reason it does not work really. So anyway, what you have to do now is just go ahead and check the link in the description. This app is on App Store for free. Just go ahead and download it. So yeah, what I would recommend you guys to go ahead and do is start off with some basic HTML, HTML5 tasks and uh, make your way up there. So you can also start with some basic JavaScript if you like. So let's start with, let's say this one. So you see, we have a couple of tasks to do here. We have to create a single line comment and a multi-line comment. So let's just say this is so freaking cool, right? And in the info, we could see that our task is completed. So we need to create a multi-line comment now. All right, let's just go ahead and do this looks cool as well. As well. And once we complete our task, what we're going to see is that's our, that our task is completed. And you can either just go ahead and review it or you could have just gone to the next one which you can do from here as well right so it's pretty cool so go ahead and try this out and let me know your feedback on this that's all for this video don't forget to subscribe and thank you for watching i'll see you then in the next one